This is a very significant day for QIC and for the Darling Downs region in general. And as Scott mentioned, it's been years in the making. The centre effectively double in size, reflecting our confidence in this region as one of the strongest local economies across the whole country. It also, importantly, ensures that a vast amount of expenditure that's escaping this region to Brisbane and the Gold Coast and the Sunshine Coast will be captured and kept here for local retailers. Can I acknowledge this morning the tremendous support this particular project has received from the Toowoomba Regional Council, the Queensland State Government, various government agencies including Ergon and Queensland Rail, and we've got representatives of those two groups with us this morning. All of those people have come together to enable us to be in a position this morning to confirm the commencement of this project. 20 years ago, when we were planning uh, Grand Central Stage 1, we actually had a bit of trouble convincing Australian retailers, national retailers, that Toowoomba would be a viable market for their brand. Uh, unsurprisingly, in 2014, that's no longer the case. The strong local economy and the positive outlook for growth has established Grand Central as one of the most productive shopping centres in Australia. The new scheme, the scheme that we're commissioning this morning, has already attracted strong interest from every major Australian retailer and it's caught the attention of a number of large international traders who have put Toowoomba firmly on their radar when they're considering their expansion plans for Australia. So we're hugely confident in the success of this project. We remain very committed to being a long-term investor on the Darling Downs. It has been a pleasure uh, as a government to be able to work with a council that has the development and the advancement of Toowoomba uh, for its people so clearly on the agenda. And uh, today's announcement, of course, fits in with the Regional Council's master plan for the city centre of Toowoomba and is another component of the great work that's been happening up here. Uh, a spend of almost $500 million by QIC, a vote of faith, uh, a vote of confidence in the Toowoomba region uh, and also uh, a vote uh, of confidence in the people of Toowoomba who will use this centre. Uh, think about what is going to happen here. A doubling of the size uh, of the shopping centre, 90,000 square metres, currently 140 uh, retail shops, another 160 retail shops and those shops will be open in two years time for a Christmas trading season. Um, adding choice, adding variety, adding jobs, adding employment. Uh, and I know uh, that ProBuild will be very happy that I put that on the agenda for them and their delay costs and all those sort of things will, will absolutely be met all the way through. But uh, uh, in terms of not only that, but also in terms of the jobs that will be created, there will be 1,500 jobs created during the construction phase and 1,000 jobs after that as the centre operates. So a burn for the economy. Meaning people from the Toowoomba region and places west will not have to travel to Brisbane, won't have to travel to the Gold Coast to do their shopping. They will be able to do it here in town at home. I look forward to uh, seeing um, the centre to my right come down and up from the ashes, a new magnificent centre. I look forward to uh, uh, parking my car in the one of the new uh, car parks. I think there are going to be a doubling of car parks from 2,000 to 4,000.